We begin the news in Lagos, Nigeria, where the police used tear gas on Wednesday to disperse protesters who gathered under the umbrella of the Revolution Now movement in Ikeja, Lagos, for a scheduled protest to demand better governance from the present administration. Plus, TV Africa's Jacinta Obiku was there and now reports. <laughs> The protest tagged National Day of Action was to mark one year of the Revolution Now movement and to relaunch the campaign for an end to the looting of public resources as well as the revamping of the social and economic fabric of the country started off peacefully. A few minutes into the protest, the Nigerian police arrived, warning protesters to disperse quietly. Their refusal to comply led to the release of tear gas by the police. This is the support scene of the Revolution Now movement, a uh, peaceful protest, which they started off well, uh, well peaceful. But at the time, we got to see the Nigerian police force trying to stop them. We could see the Nigerian police force trying to uh, release tear gas to discard these people. And at a point, the very massive crowd of the Revolution Now movement is nowhere to be found in this scene. Some Nigerians, in their reactions, opined action of the police was against democratic tenets. You see, right, they say government, democracy, this is democracy. This is not democracy. This is wrong. I support the motion because it's a normal thing that they're supposed to do because many people are suffering in this country. There are reports that the protest proposed nationwide was distracted by the police who are said to have made some arrests. Those arrested are said to have been released. Jacinta Ubiuku, Plus TV Africa.